Hide your shiny things, or they'll get stolen. Hey, I'm looking for someone who can break my speeder. Trouble with the winds, huh? Is it that obvious? Silo Rovac is the best bike modder on this side of the Hydean, but she's not keen on strangers. That's okay. Neither am I. She hasn't been around lately. Maybe her friends in Kadua know where she is. Kadua? Yeah, yeah, that's, uh... Just outside Mirogana. It's a wind fishing settlement. Right, wind fishing, obviously. Bike monitors around here. Huh, wind fishing. That must be Kadua. Hey, this is Kadua, right? Maybe. What's an off-worlder like you doing here? I'm looking for Sila Rovac. Why? You Empire? Uh, no, no. I, I heard she can rig my speeder. Silo left. We don't know where she is. Can't believe you're still protecting her after what she did. <sighs> well, I'm not. She's living cliffside, near Jaunta's Hope. Got it. Jaunta's Hope. Feel like going for a ride? Huh? How can I say no? Are you Silo? I need to kick up the power on my speeder. I don't work with off-worlders anymore. But you look like you're out of options. Got a name? <sighs> right, sorry. It's Kay. Kay Vess. I can help you, Kay. But if you want a real kick, I'll need a part. An atmospheric accelerator. The imps have one in their wind harvester. I mean, why don't I just steal it for you then? <laughs> oh, yeah? Then take these. They'll power down the turbine, and that's your way in. All right. Sounds good. I'll take care of it and meet you back here. I'll send the coordinates. We're going too slow.
Hello, how do I use those, um... Mag disruptors. Just secure them to the circuit panel near the turbine. Uh, guess I probably could have figured that out. Oh, and they're low capacity, so the charge might not last. All right. <laughs> Let's go next. Charges didn't really last. I'm past the turbine, but now my exit's blocked. Shouldn't be a problem for you, though. I mean, you are really good at this. No! <sighs> oh. <sighs> okay, uh, where was I? No, yeah, I, I am. You just think there'd be an easier way to get an atmospheric accelerator. Actually, I only made the one. It's in the converter room at the top of the harvester. Empire stole it? I gave it to them. In exchange for some off-world parts. I didn't know they'd use it to divert the winds and cut off our farmers. Well, the good news is, they won't have it for much longer. Ugh, could've used a few more of those mag disruptors. I'm okay. I'm okay. Do I get the feeling you didn't really need this thing to boost my bike? Well, I could have used something off the shelf, but this accelerator will give you a much stronger kick. <laughs> I'll be the judge of that.
must be it. I have your accelerator. It looks like this place can't run without it. I told you it has some serious kick. And hey, with the winds back to their natural course, you'll have a way out. property, huh? How can I say no? I tell you, CeeLo? Easy. I never should have made this. At least now, it'll be used for something good. Good is a bit of a stretch. Well, I like you a lot more than I like the Empire. Where's your speeder? I'll just juice the repulsor here, and you're all set. Bet it's strong enough to ride double now. Oh, really? <laughs> I meant your little pet there. Uh, yeah, me too. That's what I meant. Thanks. I should go. <laughs> See you around, Kay.
Hey, with the nav computer and your repairs, how much am I gonna owe you? Okay, we're friends. We'll get to that. <laughs> I wouldn't call us friends. You will, because I just found you an EML 850 compatible nav computer. And uh, since I know what I'm doing, it's free. <sighs> What's the catch? No catch. There's this old wreck buried in Amberine, and it's loaded with compatible parts. It's not stripped already? Look, uh, I mean, we tried. The winds picked up, and not all of us have fancy speeders. Then part of it collapsed and sealed it off. <sighs> Can't I just, like, boost one off a Pike Cruiser or something? Not possible. Trailblazer's a custom job. Off-the-shelf parts won't cut it. You're lucky I even remember this wreck. Even luckier that I have a plan. I just, uh, need a Class 11 power core. And where exactly am I supposed to get that? All kinds of places. Like, uh, you know, Imperial compounds. We barely made it out of that space station alive. <laughs> you trying to get me locked up? I'm just trying to get your ship fixed. You're welcome. And, uh, don't die, all right? Ready next? Do it. I'm at that Imperial compound, Waka. Good. Now remember, Class 11 power core. It'd probably be near an engineering area, but somewhere a little more secure. Maybe look for an office in a smaller room. Go get him, buddy.
Hold on, Nick. This part means the trailblazer will take us anywhere. We Except for life. We've come a long way from the workers' district, buddy. It's only up from here. Walker, I'm here. What do I do? All right. Install the power core and hit the capacitor with your ion blaster module. With the core in place, the door should open right up. Core goes here, I guess. Let's power up the core. Oh, he was right. Wow. Look at this place. <laughs> Walker, I'm in. Amazing, right? These High Republic cruisers were something special. Nav computer will be on the bridge, so... Good luck! I mean, a hyperdrive doesn't really need a nav computer to work, right? As long as you don't mind ending up in a black hole, no. Oh, great. And I'm guessing the bridge is still further in. Hey, if it was easy to get to, that computer would be gone by now. figure out where the bridge is.
reactor. like the weight of the bridge is shut. Hmm, maybe if we get the reactor going. To get power to the ship somehow. I, I think I'm at the reactor. Hmm. That's your best bet. It's probably a multi step activation from bottom to top. If it works at all. <laughs> all right. That should warm it up. up. Now let's see if it'll power the rest of the ship. Okay, I think we gotta climb up to the top. I think I'm almost there. Uh -huh. That's great. <sighs> yeah. You okay? Huh? Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, just fixing the trailblazer. Hurry it up, okay? that lift to come down.
Okay. <gasps> I made it. Huh? Oh, yeah, perfect. Nav computer will be in the console. Okay. <sighs> I can't pry this open. I think it needs authorization. All right. Authorization granted. To see scrap the nav computer and... Those are Zarek Bash agents. How did they find us? Let's blow that up. Right about this mix. Let's grab it and go. Now. This looks like a nav computer. Don't be mad, Kay. I mean, I knew what she needed. I know what she's been through. I'm the one who fixed her. You're gonna kill me for a ship? No. For the trailblazer. Zarek Besh wanted you alive, but I can't afford any loose ends. Neither can I. Fail, right? If this is about Slero's ship or the Rebels, it's just a big, big misunderstanding. I don't care. Uh, at least hear me out. Here. Enough. Just come quietly. Who are you? Run. I said, run. What was that? No, no, no. We need to get out of here next. Keep running. We'll, we'll jump to anywhere else if the ship's even there. Oh, this can't keep happening. From now on, it's just you and me, Nix, like it should be.
That veil person almost had us. We need to get rid of this death mark. Fast. <laughs> We need to get out of here. She'll be here any minute, I'm sure. You hear that, Nix? Kves. We meet at last. Who are you? Saving you was hard. <clears throat> I'd rather not kill you. You have a name? Jalen Vrax. And I hear you got into Slero's mansion without these. Where'd you get this? It's what I do. Secrets, contacts, credits. I'm the one who brings them all together. King Ferrick, this really is Lero's mansion, isn't it? Mm-hmm. And the schematics for a safe filled with 157 million credits worth of unmarked Beskar ingots. And I can get you inside. Uh-huh. You got a droid smith to shut up that gatekeeper? Enough explosives to blow through that chromium time lock. And don't forget, Slero's amped up security since your last little visit. You'll need two slicers to get in. Get in? How about getting out? If it wasn't for Nyx, I'd be in the ground. You'd need an enforcer. You'd need a whole crew. That's right. With half the prize to split however you like. This job, it's a death wish. Well, you're already dead, okay? Slero runs the most lethal syndicate I've ever seen, and he wants you gone. You want to live? Push back. Rob his fortune and buy your freedom. <laughs> that easy. There's a reason people like me don't push back on people like Slero. Survival. Exactly. And I, for one, am tired of fighting for the scraps left by rich, overdressed tyrants like Slero. This is our chance. You and I can break him, together. You really don't like this guy. I'm just trying to tip the scales for people like us, Kay. What do you think? I'm in. ND5 has the list. Track him down, get our crew. Oh, and... Don't stab me in the back. Andy's programmed to make sure that doesn't happen. Galaxy is yours. You believe that? I believe if you follow the plan, no one gets hurt. Great. So, uh... What are the rules here? How do we make this work? You don't betray Jalen, and I don't blast you. <laughs> so you're my babysitter? If that is what you want to call it, fine. With Slero after you, you clearly need protection. What's Slero's problem? He runs a whole syndicate. Who cares about one stolen ship? You broke into his mansion, hit his vault, and stole his ship. I imagine Slero wants you and whoever you worked for to disappear for good. With me on board, you might live long enough to complete the job this time. Uh-huh. Just, uh, stay out of my way, all right? Now let's go. Okay. Whenever you're ready, KFS. Let's get out of here.
without one. Oh, right. The team. Uh, I know a droidsmith on Akiva. What do we do about the others? Jalen's left you a list of contacts, and I've plotted their coordinates. Do you want to recruit your own droidsmith? I can tell him. Other than that, there's a heavy we could recruit on Tatooine, and a safe cracker on Kajimi. Which is where I'd recommend going first. But it's your choice. Calculating hyperdrive coordinates. Vess isn't working alone. Before I built Zarek Bersh, my family built ships on Corellia. Did you know that? I did not. This model, the EML 850. Inconspicuous, virtually indestructible, perfect for the underworld. But they were expensive. Durasteel plating alone cost a fortune. There was a BX commander. Fortunately. There were other ships that could do the job for much less. I just need more time. I hire you because you are one of the best hunters in the Outer Rim. Then I tell you someone broke into my private vaults and stole one of the last EML 850s in the galaxy, and you assumed she was working alone. Do you know what happened to these ships? Uh... Destroyed. Repurposed. Scrapped. Do you understand? I'll find her. I just need... <laughs> 